So Catherine and I thought it would be fun to go to two celebrity chef restaurants in Las Vegas and order the same or similar dishes and have them fight it out as if they're on Iron Chef. We're going to pit Emeril Lagasse versus Martha Stewart in today's episode. So let's see whose cuisine reigns supreme. First, we're headed to Martha Stewart's The Bedford at Paris, Las Vegas, and then we'll be going to Emeril Lagasse's Seafood Restaurant at the MGM Grand. This is the menu at the Bedford. We're looking to get an appetizer and an entree. The crab cake, $32.95. And the bouillabaisse, $59.95. The last time we were here at the Bedford by Martha Stewart, we ordered a $90 whole roast chicken carved tableside. A change of the menu is that you can now order a half roast chicken. It's not carved tableside, but you can get a half chicken for $49.95. Another new item added to the menu is the bouillabaisse, which is what we'll be getting today. Yeah, so some things have been added and some things have been removed from the menu. One of the things they've added is a prefix menu for $99.95 where you can get the Caesar salad, the Big Martha's pierogies, that half-roasted chicken, and an upside-down lemon meringue pie. All for $99.95. Jump on the side and the side of celeric slaw. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. This is the crab cake at Martha Stewart's The Bedford. All right, you want to tell me how this is described on the menu? Absolutely. This is the crab cake. It's one of the appetizers. It is jumbo lump crab meat with roasted yellow peppers and a celery slaw. This is $32.95. Can you see that? There's some Malden sea salt right yeah. on top. Let's see. I think I do see some lump crab meat some... and it's piping hot. Yeah, it's piping up. There's definitely some jumbo lump right here, yeah. here as well. It's very hot. This looks great. Mm. It almost tastes kind of a little lemony. Just put more sauce on. Okay. Yeah, the sauce is very thick and creamy. The crab cake is lightly crunchy, and it does have lump meat inside. The sea salt that was on top, I'm getting a definitely a hit of that, which is nice. It really kind of brightens up and complements the other flavors in this filling. I love the light crunch of the crab cake. It's really nice. It's nice with contrast with the texture. That's really good. Really nicely seasoned. This, this is good. I like this. And this is $33. Yes, this is $33 for one jumbo lump crab cake. Um, I thought there'd be, I was hoping for a little more jumbo lump yeah. crab meat, but we got, definitely got some in the center, which is good. And it tastes really good. Thank you. You're welcome. This looks incredible. This is the bouillabaisse. base. You want to tell me exactly how this is described on the menu? I'd be happy to. This is the bouillabaisse here at the Bedford with Martha Stewart. This has four types of seafood. We have lobster, halibut, snapper, and mussels. And you see your two pieces of bread, toast, served with louis, which is a French-style sauce served with seafood. And this is $59.95. We have here some lobster. Looks like we have a claw. And we also have a part of the lobster here. This is fresh to share. I'll, I'll get the claw since it's yeah. right here on top. That's a grab. One of the pieces of toast. This looks wonderful. I think I'll start with the fish. Let me just get a bite of the fish with some broth. It's very nice. And then we have some lobster here. So you have a lobster claw. It just tastes like the soup. It just tastes like the bouillabaisse now. All right, let me try this lobster tail. This looks great. Mm -hmm. mm. mm -hmm. Kind of juicy. Mm -hmm. How about this bread with yes. this, this sauce? Mm -hmm.
It, it looks like mustard and it kind of tastes like mustard. Okay. What is it like with the broth? I'm curious. Yeah, let's try it with the broth. Just dip it in a little bit. Mm -hmm. mm. Kind of spices it up. Oh. Like with mustard. <laughs> All the different sea pieces of seafood, they taste like themselves. Like there's nothing. Yeah. They, they just really taste the... the the seafood in this dish, which is nice. I will say this bouillabaisse tastes quite elegant. And like uh, this is like what you get at a formal dinner party at Martha Stewart's house. Whereas what I'm expecting from emeralds is more of kind of more of a shrimp boil type, mm -hmm. you know, flavor mm -hmm. where it's just just real homey tasting. This 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 tastes like you'd have something uh, at a very expensive home. Mm. <laughs> it feels very refined. Yes. And the total here at the Bedford, $100 for the crab cakes and the bouillon base. Now on to emeralds. All right, we are at Emeralds Fish House at the MGM Grand, and we're going to be getting the same dishes more or less as we got at Martha Stewart's. We're going to get the crab cakes, and we're going to get the Piri Piri seafood, which is essentially like a seafood stew, just like bouillon base, more or less. And this is the menu at Emeralds. As you can see, they have a jumbo lump crab cake right here for $28. It's raw chilled seafood. And they actually have some specials for today. The market board, oysters, mussels, sea bass. Oh, Oscar style blackened Hawaiian ahi. I'd have to come back for that next I time. I know, what do you think? I saw that, that caught my eye too. That sounded yeah. really, really good. But here is the, the the seafood piri piri. That's what we'll be getting for fifty-five dollars in addition to our crab cakes. The crab cake. The crab cake. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. The sauce is going to be a lemon rather goat, uh, aioli based, fresh herbs, touch of citrus, salt, pepper to finish. There is a little creole. On top of the crab cake is uh, carrots, peppers, and onions. It is all blue crab meat in the crab cake. No filler. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we got our crab cake. You want yeah. to tell me exactly how this is described on the menu? I'd be happy to. This is the jumbo lump crab cake here at Emerald's New Orleans Fish House at the MGM Grand. This is fresh herb ravigo on the side, served with a pickled sweet pepper salad on top. And this is $28. Now, we did get some, some free bread when we first sat down here. It looks like some kind of corn bread. We didn't get any complimentary bread at Martha Stewart, so that's that's a point for Emerald. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we'll give it a quick taste just to see what type of bread this is. Mm. Cornbread. All right, you want to give that crab cake a try? I'd love to. Let me move this to the side here so I can cut through the crab cake. Yes. Now you said it was all crab meat, no filler. Yes. Let's see how this looks on the inside Ooh. here. It does look full it, of crab. Yeah, then there's the big jumbo lump pieces right here wow. in the center. You see big pieces of jumbo lump in there for sure. Let's, yeah, let's taste this. No sauce, let's so try this first. I definitely taste the crab meat more here with this crab cake than at Martha Stewart's. I get a really nice crab flavor. The exterior is not as crunchy as the one we had earlier, but it's, the flavors of the crab meat really shine through, and it tastes very nice. It's, I'm very impressed with the meatiness of the crab cake. Yeah, this definitely looks more lumpy. Mm -hmm. It's definitely more lumpy. It's more loose as well. It's mm -hmm. not, has doesn't quite have that same crispy outside, but the mm -hmm. inside is actually, it's almost like moist, like super light, mm -hmm. much more light than the Martha Stewart one, which was a good crab cake. Yes. But this one tastes more like crab, mm -hmm. like it has more crab 
meat in it, uh -huh. less filler. Right. It said there was almost like no filler, yeah. right? This one is, is smaller in size and height, but I think it has more crab meat. Wow. And it's a little cheaper. And it is a little cheaper, that's true. Oh, you want to try that with some sauce? I do. Let's try this herb ravigo on the side. Mm. Ooh. That's so flavorful. It's so bold with the herb. It doesn't taste like a, a tartar sauce. That's really nice. It goes well with this crab cake. Try this salad here. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, it's kind of like those, those pickled carrots and jalapenos at like Mexican places. That's true. <laughs> it, it does like taste that. like that. <laughs> Let me try it with this, the sauce. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh. oh yeah, really herby mm -hmm. and creamy. Yeah, yeah it's, it's very nice, herbaceous. Nice accompaniment. Thank, Thank you. you. It's beautiful. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Thank you. We're nope, good. Okay. Thank you. Wow, this is the Piri Piri. This is the mixed seafood stew here at Emeralds. All right, we've got our Piri Piri. You want to tell me exactly how this is described on the menu? I'd be happy to. Right here is the seafood pity pity. It is fresh catch of the day, which today is steelhead trout, jumbo shrimp, black mussels, homemade chorizo, and creamy Anson Mills grits underneath, and fresh basil. This is $55. All right, you want to help yourself yes. to the Piri Piri? Yeah, let's, first let's take a look at what we have in yeah. here. We have the mussels right here. You can see the jumbo shrimp. Look at this. Mm. That is a big piece of shrimp, yeah. big shrimp right there. And underneath, you can see the Anson Mills grits as like a base. Yep. For everything, and the chorizo is cut up into right. sausage. Sausage right here. There's chorizo here. Let's let me serve myself some yep. and try this. Let's see, the, there's more shrimp. Oh, there it is. There, oh, there. It's a big piece right here underneath. Wow. It's, this is a. This is, oh, that's a. Wow. It, this is a portion of the fresh catch of the day, the steelhead right. trout. I'll just split this in half for us yep. here. Let's try the fresh catch, the steelhead trout. This is so good. This is really smoky, really great flavors. Let me try one more bite. The fresh catch, the trout, tastes fantastic. Oh, and there again, there's so many components here. We have potatoes. Let's try this house-made chorizo. Mm. It's very flavorful, but it's not spicy. Oh wait, oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it would be. <laughs> it, 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 it wasn't initially, but a little bit of heat came in. It's like a mild to medium heat. But the shrimp is also yeah. huge. Like it's, I'll just cut off a small piece now. See these portions here. Mm. That's a delicious piece of shrimp. All right, I want to try this mussel. They gave us a tiny little fork to get the meat out of the mussel. Mm -hmm. So let's get it out. Okay. That yeah. was easy. That was very easy. Mm. Very mild, but very meaty. Mm -hmm. mm, that's good. Need some more sauce on it, though. Let me get just load up my plate with some of this stuff. Here. Oh, sure. There's a lot going on. Yeah. All right. I want to try this fish, the steelhead trout. Peppery and also very meaty. Mm. It's still very light. Wow. Okay. Right. How about this chorizo sausage? Mm. Oh, 
Oh, that's so good too. A little spice starting to kick in. Right. But also very meaty, just very hearty. Mm -hmm. I'll say this is definitely a heartier dish than the bouillabaisse uh, at Martha Stewart's. So yeah, definitely sharing it. <laughs> yeah, this is the one to get. But mm -hmm. we'll reserve our judgment for the very end. So yes. here, would you like to have this other shrimp? Here yes, please. Yes, please. There. Thank you. And maybe you want this one too? Oh, thank <laughs> you. That. Thank you. I'll have some more of the sausage and grits. Grits. <laughs> You want to try to get all that shrimp out of I'm there? I'm going to do my best. It's a little tricky. In the, it's a little tricky. It's big. We're getting out of the tail part. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey. Nice job. Mm. <laughs> now, of course, Emerald is famous for his banana cream pie, but we won't be getting dessert today. Leave a comment if you want us to come back to Emerald's New Orleans Fish House and try more, including dessert. All right, we got the check. $89.95 for the crab cake and the piri piri. Stay tuned because we're going to be going outside and we'll give you our final verdict. So in a battle of Iron Chef <laughs> Martha Stewart versus Iron Chef Emeril Lagasse, whose cuisine reigns supreme? What do you think? I'm going to give it to Emeril. Emeril, why? Because crab I've, cake, crab piri cake. piri. Well, got crab cake wise, we had more jumbo lump crab in the crab cake at Emeralds as opposed to Martha's. Yeah. The flavor was better. It was also a little bit cheaper. <laughs> it was. And I think I have to agree on all counts, Emerald comes out tops. We did enjoy Martha's food. I mean, the restaurant is very nice. It feels a little more stuffy, dare I say, in there, a little more relaxed at Emeralds. Mm -hmm. So I will also give this to Emerald Lagasse. Congratulations, <laughs> Iron Chef Emerald Lagasse. You retain the crown of Iron Chef. Better luck next time, Martha. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you liked it, leave a comment. Let us know what you think about Emerald Lagasse and Martha Stewart. And be sure to subscribe for more. It's free.